Hello fellow YouTubers, this is N0AGI. I'm here to do a short video of my turnkey uh, deployable APRS iGate and Digipeter uh, box. I'm getting ready to deploy a, uh, a Digipeter and an iGate on a nearby water tower. So I thought I'd uh, put this box together so that I can uh, take it with me and quickly install it uh, at the site. Um, so I thought I'd do a quick uh, walkthrough of the of this box here. This box is from a local Axman store, the Axman Surplus Store. Um, it's a fairly durable uh, PVC enclosure, uh, mostly um, you know it's made for electrical projects if you will so what I did was I converted this uh, to suit um, the APRS iGate and Digipeter turnkey uh, box so let me do a quick show here so what I have here is a uh, my Yesu FT2900 it is installed, or rather it's powered by the Yesu uh, FP1020 power supply at the bottom there. The power supply is, is uh, fastened to the enclosure at the bottom and then the radio is, is mounted to this bracket that came with the radio and the bracket is mounted to the, the power supply's case. Uh, again, nothing fancy, but uh, but I thought I'd do a quick show here. Uh, the power supply also supplies to the the two uh, uh, inlet exhaust fan and the outlet exhaust fan, so so as to help circulate uh, the air. And provide some ventilation to the uh, to the equipment on the inside. From the outside, I have the power supply uh, through a grommet, the network cable uh, because uh, this should go to my the eye gate uh, device, which I will be installing fairly soon, which will probably go right by here, um, right beside the equipment here. And and then of course the uh, th this inlet here is for the uh, the LMR 400 cable. And on the inside, um, I uh, I have used these. I don't know what these are called, but I think there's some sort of a, a fastener to hold the the wires together so they so they don't slip and fall or unplug themselves. Uh, the radio is it has a dual fuse box and that goes to the uh, the power supply and the power supply also uh, supplies power to the two fans and uh, to the um, future um, the eye gate device that will be mounted right about here so that's pretty much it and basically basically the goal of this project is to uh, deploy it quickly and uh, get it up and running as a turnkey project uh, let me uh, power this up and I'll show you how it works thanks so I just powered it up uh, let me turn on the power supply uh, this fan here is supposed to bring uh, the interior air and throw it outward and and this fan is supposed to bring the air inward so as to provide a ventilation so let me turn it on the radio is currently powered off but uh, right now it doesn't do anything beyond so let me turn it on.
so the power supply supplies power both to the radio to the two fans and to the digipeter uh, currently so that's pretty much it so this is the air from the inside out and this is the air from the outside going inward um, so that's it thanks for watching this will go up on the water tower in the next uh, week or so so as to provide a APRS digipeter and eye gate service there are a couple of gaps in the north and south Dakota area and southwest of Minnesota area so I'm hoping this will help fill that ga gap for the APRS uh, digipeter and eye gate service uh, we'll talk soon thanks for watching bye